Om Shanti, welcome back to your own channel, see the soul, the truth lies within and now we are recording the 12th day that is today, present day's blessing and if you have listened to the yesterday's blessing that is 11th day of blessing, if you liked it, do share it with others, make a change in other people's lives, earn blessings by sharing it with others. So let's see what does Baba have to say in this blessing and Baba is talking about kicking away sadness, yes, how to kick away sadness. Let's explore that. But Baba says in the heading, may you become full of the treasure of happiness. And by keeping the awareness of having all attainments, what have you attained? The world is looking for God. The world is trying to find out what is the knowledge of that supreme being that if it is attained, then they will be complete salvation for the soul it's like an elixir of life will be attained and the soul will be immortal again so what is that knowledge so god has given us that knowledge that elixir of life god has given us in seven days course at brahma kumaris where we the souls who are dead are awakened dead doesn't mean physically but spiritually dead and we are awakened and we can see through things we can see what's happening in life what is good, what is bad and that makes us more powerful whether we are losing, whether we are winning in this physical world whereas whether somebody is giving us fame or whether somebody is defaming us in this world whether you have victory or whether you have defeat in this world God says with this attainment of knowledge you will always be constant whereas the rest of the world will be saddened, will be Moaning, will be howling, crying, blaming, getting angry, getting frustrated. But with this knowledge, you'll never be sad. So what is that? You learn that in the seven days course. But we're going to touch a few things over here in this blessing. At the confluence age, a age where hell is turning to heaven. Kali is hell is going to turn into heaven. That means Satyug on earth is coming very soon couple of years left all at the confluence age all of your children receive the treasure of happiness from the father for this no matter what happens even if you have to shed your body do not let go of your treasure of happiness when somebody is soul conscious they practice soul consciousness then leaving their body and at that time having attachments to people and things is not even the last thought on their mind they are happily leaving the body because they don't have attachments to people they don't have, don't have attachments to things they don't have attachments to the names and laurels which they have earned or the attainments or the titles or the post and the position and the power which they earned this in this life whether it's financial power whether it's any power those souls don't have any attachment so they are happy even while leaving the body <coughs> constantly Keep the awareness of having all attainments and sadness will then be kicked away. Even if there is some loss in your business, do not let any waves of sadness enter your mind because what is the big deal about that when compared to your infinite attainment, knowing that secret of knowledge, how to behave, how to think, how to perform, how to talk, how to act, so that the passport to the purest world that is heaven is in your hands even if you're losing lakhs in this hell so god says even if you're losing in business but if you remember the attainment you won't be sad you won't be affected if you have happiness you have everything and if you don't have happiness you have nothing so i can live my life you can live your life everybody has to leave the body either we can be irritated we can be frustrated or we can be content like in the yesterday's blessing give blessings receive blessings from others be content be happy and happiness and contentment go hand in hand so what is that knowledge which makes you happy even in such troublesome times even if you are losing even if somebody is defaming you even if there is loss, how do you remain stable? 
that's what you learn in, learn in the seven days Brahma Kumari's course. Do join it, do learn it. You're not being charged for that course. With this, Om Shanti. Thank you.